He's doing all the things we're asking him to do, and uh, he's uh, um, doing a great job of being a, a leader on our offense, and uh, we know we're trying to get better and that we're a work in progress in some areas, and he's continuing to, to work at it. And you know, if, if we can keep getting better each week, and we'll see how it all pans out, but this maybe is one of, one of his more satisfying years as far as um, um, you know, how he interacts with players and all that. Being a leader. Well, you know what? Uh, in the case of a victory, it would mean a lot. Uh, but you know, uh, definitely when there's no success as a team, it really doesn't resonate with me at that moment because uh, you know you're so focused on the now and not you know so much the, the entire journey that you know I've been thankful to be a part of. I mean, shoot, playing as many years as I've played, 17 years total. I mean, you know, this has been quite a journey, and I'm very thankful for it. And definitely, uh, once my career is over, you know, it'll be something I'll be able to reflect back on and. You know, I'll probably say wow to myself because, you know, just thinking of the fact that I went over 53, it, it really didn't hit me until probably a couple of days after the game that, man, that's a heck of a lot of yards. And I really, I didn't realize that I had accomplished that. But, you know, something that definitely in the end, it'll hit me. Uh, but right now, my mind's so focused on the present and uh, getting that victory this upcoming Sunday. To me, that, that's the most important thing in my mind right now. I would say uh, your chances of going past number three into two or one are very slim because Damon Allen and Anthony yeah, yeah. I'm not trying to catch those two. <laughs>